the record heat that's slamming the valley. And it's not only shattering temperature records, we could be setting new ones for energy demands as well. Team 12's Trisha Hendricks has the story. As the temperatures rise, so does the energy use. This is the lifeblood of the economy. We need to make sure that we have enough power so people can live in the desert. After breaking long-held energy records in June of 2017, APS is preparing for the hottest days of this year. Energy experts ensuring enough energy to keep customers' air conditioners humming through the heat. This is not a place that you can live without uh, air conditioning. Director of Resource Planning with APS, Jeff Burke, says APS has to make sure they can meet those loads and provide reliable service year round, especially during the times when excessive heat warnings are in effect. When we get temperatures that are to the order of 115 plus, uh, that drives our peak loads. Everybody wants to be home. They want to be comfortable. The plans they've created get executed on the trading floor of the APS headquarters building downtown Phoenix. This is where traders are working to find the best ways for customers to save money. We plan for this years in advance. The folks around this room are constantly monitoring power uh, in the region uh, to buy, sell whatever's needed. Here's how it works. As the day goes on and loads go higher, which is this number up here, uh, we'll see all the green lights come on on all the black boxes. That's because power consumption is rising, so they'll slowly start up all of their units to make sure they can keep the lights on and, of course, your AC running. When it comes to this time of year, we want to make sure that people don't have to worry about their power. If we do break any energy records, these experts say they're prepared. Trisha Hendricks, 12 News.